Hello everyone, um, sorry if I sound weird, I have a cold. Sit. When you know how to sit. I am teaching Sheska here how to walk off leash. So, I have her on a 15 foot leash, and then I have it tied around my waist. See? I would tie it around my waist, and then I have that. In case she poops. Yeah. And she's got a Jenna leader on because I did walk her without Jenna leader and she got distracted easily. So, sorry. And then I got this. Yeah. It's jerky. She loves this stuff. I put this in her kennel that um, my uncle's friend gave to us because she already outgrew the silver one. Let's go. <laughs> Now, she, she's very, keep moving, she's very attached to me, because she did escape out of this yard one time, and sadly, it was the one day that she didn't have any of these on, she didn't have any of her tags on, she just had a, a collar on, but, <clears throat> but she, she didn't jump the fence or anything, she just, she found a hole in the fence and kind of snuck through that. And where the hole in the fence was led right to the highway. But luckily, she's so attached to me that she did, she did leave, she did run. And she doesn't know come yet. Hey, come. She's kind of off and on with come. Hey, but we're here. <clears throat> I kept calling her, and she wouldn't come, and then I think, because she's so attached to me, that's what cattle dogs are, they get, they're they very loyal to their person, once they imprint on someone, they're very loyal to them, and very attached. Hey! So, even though she does this to me sometimes, she still loves me. We do get her back because I think that she's realized, you know, she, was, she escaped and then she was barking. It was kind of like a, hey, wait a minute, where'd my mom go bark? So I'm just testing this out. So she's got this long leash and it's attached to me. And yes, I'm in my pajamas. I don't care if people see me like this. And I'm just seeing how she does. And so far, she does this. She sticks pretty close by me. She stays within the boundaries of the leash. It's just like, you know, like the workman down there. Or there's a bull mastiff earlier. A lady walking her bull mastiff. She gets very distracted, but she's a puppy, so that's to be expected. She kind of has, you know, the brain capacity of a gnat. But she's done really well. It's just, you know, she's learning how to deal with distractions still. Hey, come here. Come on. Come here. Jessica, come. Good girl. Yeah, good girl. Yeah. Good girl. Good girl. And people, just FYI, when you're teaching your puppy to come, and if they do, say like she did, get out of the yard, Even though, you know, I was, I was scared and I was angry at her that she, you know, escaped the yard and ran away. You have to be so happy that they came back and you have to just praise them so much. Like I just did. She came when I called her and you just gotta praise her. Little puppies, you gotta use that high-pitched baby voice. You just gotta hard when you're sick. So if you want to teach your dog to walk off leash. I suggest starting with this. My mom got us this leash. It's just 15 feet. But I suggest that you just start with this. And you don't have to have a gentle le leader for your dog, but it does give you more control on the walk. And she pulls, and she's pretty strong for her size. She's only 25 pounds. And she's kind of little. She's five, she's almost six months. In a week, she'll be six months old. And 
then she's gonna get spayed. Yeah. And hopefully that'll calm you down, because you are kind of crazy. But she had daycare in class last night, so she's still kind of... She's usually tired the next day after that. Hey, stay out of there. But just any, any dog that you get, just make sure you walk them. And if you want to teach them to walk off leash, like I would love her to walk off leash one day. Which I know it's not going to be overnight. Which, with anything, it's not overnight. But you just got to work with them. And I suggest doing this, just give it a nice long leash, and you just wrap it around your waist, hook them to the other end, and then see if they do this. But puppies will get distracted, I mean, they're like little kids. Hey, out of the tall grass. Hey, you have the attention span of a goldfish, so just be careful. Make sure they are secure. That's why she's hooked to the gentle leader and her martingale. Because I started doing that when I hooked the pit bull to his martingale, or sorry, to his gentle leader. Oh, it made me lose my shoe. Come on, Goofy. Hey, come on. <whistles> yes, come. Come. Come, 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 come. Come, 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 come. Good girl. Yes, yes, good girl. Good girl. But, uh, <clears throat> all right, it's getting kind of windy, so I'm going to have my mouth closer to the phone. But I started, hang on, Jessica. Stop. I said stop. See how it's hooked to her gentle leader, Anna Martingale? Come on. This is what she does when she has a gentle leader on. She just does this. And it's kind of a pain in the ass to walk her, because that's all she does. She'll walk, and then if she gets in grass, she'll roll. I started doing, I started uh, hooking the leash to the Martingale and the gentle leader, because the pit bull that we take care of, which we haven't seen in a while, but that's another story. I put his dental leader on him in the house, and then he oh, got yeah. out of it. He got out of his dental leader in the house, thankfully not outside. So ever since then, I've been hooking the dental leader to the martingale, because you know, <laughs> stop it. Just in case they get out of the dental leader, I at least have them on the collar. Leave the little girl alone. No one knows that she's a complete idiot. But that she just she just wants to play. Yeah, you. And she's just a big she's moody. She's a big moody baby. But little kids don't know that when she starts barking at them, they get scared. And run to their mothers. So we're trying to teach you to be gentle. Anyway, I'm gonna stop talking. And uh, yeah. See you guys later. Bye.